In one of the arm wrestling pulling session of Dennis, we saw him pulling Valera by sacrificing the wrist, and the match went to a complete endurance test for Dennis Siplenkov, and he holded Valera for about one minute until Valera had nothing left to do, and then Dennis Siplenkov suddenly gathered some strength and pinned Valera in a flash, and this tells us a lot about Dennis's endurance, but that's not it. True Power uploaded recent progress report of Dennis Siplenkov in which they shared Dennis improved with every training sessions that they did on Monday and Saturday and they checked the improvement of Dennis on Thursday. One thing that they shared was earlier training partners of Dennis were able to at least move Dennis Siplenkov from the center but now they cannot even do that. Dennis is now feeling like a tank to them. They also said Dennis is feeling like a wall now. So current Dennis has both endurance and strength. And believe me, these are the most important things in winning any super match. So Dennis is training very very smartly. I have mentioned it to you guys that Dennis gave a lot of importance to endurance. He believes super matches are won by endurance. Because after the first round, power starts to decrease in a significant amount and endurance plays an important role. And we are also seeing Dennis doing some lifting, some good amount of weight as well. And we are also seeing Dennis Siplenkov lifting some good weights as well. Now you all know Alexei Vovuda is very good with the weights right now and looks like Dennis was better than Alexei in seated bicep curl. And of course, Dennis used to be a monster in lifting weights. We have not seen the pulling session of Alexi vs Dennis but I am sure Dennis would have took Govoda the same way Dennis took the Dikyan. So that's all for this video guys. What do you think? Will Devon hit a wall on 11 November 2023 or will Devon break the wall? Comment down below. See you in the next video. Thank you very much for watching.